Bonjour, mon ami. Welcome to our channel. And today we will speak about top 10 best-selling fragrances in August. Yeah. So we will start with number 10. It's Grishaner by BDK. Yeah. This fragrance is uh, really good for fall. And I think uh, people start preparing. preparing for cold times, fall times, this murky weather, rainy weather. So uh, this fragrance starts with fig, black tea, spices a little bit, but also uh, on the dry down it adds uh, more creaminess, like kind of enveloping creaminess uh, because of tonka bean and sandalwood. So you can feel it a little bit salty. I would say this one is absolutely unisex and I can see for girls it's more bossy vibes if you like kind of in this style and for boys uh, doesn't matter <laughs> doesn't matter <laughs> it's if you want to just feel feel yourself unusual in a good way not like everyone else it smells something really interesting and unusual in a good way so number nine a uh, new brand in our store yeah uh, Bora Bora Giardini de Toscana and this one is a really really rich creamy, sweet fragrance yes. with apricot, tiara, jasmine, creamy notes, a lot of creamy notes, vanilla for sure, and the musk. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, absolutely beautiful and something really cozy. Exactly. Again, <laughs> Herbapura yeah, by Xero Joe. Yeah, from the last month it comes again. And um, I have a feeling so next month it will have it again. So. Herb Herba Pura, more about passion fruit, fruits, uh, starting with a uh, more fresh, bright, and um, kind of crispy bergamot and citruses, mm -hmm. but develop into the passion fruit, musk. So it's something that uh, definitely turn heads around you. So it's not summer. It's not summer. Uh, but, this uh, but they still, if, uh, like, I feel like it's for summer, uh, a fragrance for summer, but. There is no summer anymore, but it yeah. is still buying. For, for me, it's not a summer fragrance. For me, it's more cold weather fragrance because of the mask. Next move. Next, number 10, 9, 8, 7. <laughs> Arabian Stonka by Mantai. Yeah, always. <laughs> it's always one. Sophisticated, though. rich, creamy. But this fragrance basically is about wood, tonka bean, creamy vibes, and sophistication of Baccarat Rouge but in much more, for me, younger manner. Agree. Next. Welcome back. Number... Five. Five, six, ten, nine, eight, seven. Number six, Baccarat Rouge. Baccarat Rouge. Five, forty. Yeah. So... Can there I is say, no, no words to say. No words to yeah. say. Masterpiece. <clears throat> so, number five. Lemon Tart by Teodoros Kavatinis. Yep. This one is... Really photorealistic lemon tart with the butter, sugar, lemon dust. Yeah, <laughs> everything that you want to eat. And I think this is perfect for fall evening when you want to stay home and watch Netflix. And feel or read a book. Cozy and relaxed. Or read a book. So another Theodore Scottini's coffee addict. Yeah. All, all <laughs> gourmand lovers and coffee lovers, that fragrance yeah, is for you. Starting with really the ready like coffee, coffee and slowly moving to the coffee with caramel. Really good as well. So, um, number three. Number three, Sonic Flower, room 1015. Yeah, second skin fra fragrance that reminds from a lot of people glossier you, but in much more vivid manner. Carrot seeds, pink pepper, musk, powdery. violet, powdery, fresh, fruity, Smells like pure juice for me without without the without the sugar. Number two, Bois Imperial by Essential yeah. Perfume, and it's something happened to Bois Imperial. It's it, number two, yeah. <laughs> not first one. For the first time, for I think six months, and Bois Imperial number two, this fresh, woodsy, inoffensive uh, in the public, staying pretty good about eight hours on the skin. Comfortable fragrance, which everyone thinks it smells like natural. This fragrance, number two, right now. And, and number, number one. one. 
It's Bianca Latte by Giardini de Toscana. Yeah, extremely it, it, yeah. vanilla fragrance. So here is vanilla, caramel, and honey. Only three notes that listed uh, behind this fragrance. But what I can say, for me, it smells like you're taking a bath with Cleopatra, and the bath is from warm, spiced milk. So it have a sexy vibes. Yeah, in front. So it have a really sexy vibes. Projection is something unbelievable. Stays on <laughs> the skin long. more than 12 hours. Yeah, and I think um, this fragrance deserved the first place in August. In August, yeah. We will see uh, another top 10 fragrances uh, in September. Yep. In a few weeks. Yep. So we will see which one will stay uh, in this in the same position you can uh, tell us in the comments what do you think about uh, fragrances which we will see in september list yep. that's all for for today hope to see you soon in the store <laughs> or in the comments on our videos yes like subscribe and comment and stay fragrant see you see you